Welcome to DIY Solar and Wind and welcome to Sarge Adventures. So I just hooked up solar pole heater. There you go, the one solar panel, 550 foot of hose. So that's how I'm going to heat the swimming pool. I've had a heck of a fiasco and I got a new pump in. That's the old pump and I lost the cap for the filter. So. Now I got I got spare set of everything now. So here's this in a nutshell. It's all solar. The sun is going down. I got a little little bit on the panel right now, but it's working. And here's the little pump. I don't know if I'm gonna get a good angle on that, but I got that on eBay. You can click on the link down below. It's 109 gallons an hour. But you're not going to get it with this, all that resistance. There's no way. Now this is some pump hose, one and a quarter inch. So when you do this, and you want to do make a solar pool heater, there's a wire right there. And I got a, I had to get a, I forget the name of it, trail wire to go in. You can, with a DC, voltage you can't put the the wires underwater the pump will still work just to let you know but see if I can get it here now if you want all this contraption stuff you can go to your local do it center and they will fabricate it for you from a garden hose fitting to this 109 gallon pump so that's 12 volt DC and hopefully you can find it because it's already threaded for the garden hose. Now see, I just filled it up with a garden hose for the last two days so that I got that fitting because coming out of the ground, that water is very, very cold. So I run it through the solar pool heater and then into the pool. That was 64 degrees when I came home, but yeah, it's 65 now. But soon it'll be all cleaned up now that I got the filter on and everything. So all in due time, this will be spotless. And in a couple days, hopefully it'll be 80 degrees in the pool. Most summers I have to unplug it because I don't like getting in the water at 85 degrees. <laughs> Just one solar panel. Oh, the pump is 45, 45 watts, and I got a 100-watt solar panel on it. So it's plenty. So even on a cloudy day, or even though the sun is behind the clouds, it's still running. Um, on cloudy days, when well, the sun is not on the hose, it's still ambient temperature, it's still going to be 80 degrees, it's still going to be heating, heating the pool. So uh, hot sunny days, uh, sometimes I come home and it will be, uh, the hottest is 106 degrees going right back into the swimming pool. That is beautiful. All right, that's my own contraption. I thought it all up. I did see some videos on YouTube, but these were the supplies that I got, and I had to re-engineer it several times through the years. These are just some of the solar panels. All right, thanks for watching, and have a nice sunny day.